Okay, so I'm going to continue uh, our daffodil flower. My video got cut off before. So you have your six petals all glued together, so you have your um, petal part of your daffodil. And you want to take that long piece of orange or white or yellow paper that you have, and you're going to make some nice wide bumps, a bumpy line that goes right along the top to touch the top edge. And then on the bottom, you're going to make some vertical lines, maybe about three or four fingers apart. We're going to need those for tabs so that we can glue this down onto our petals. So I'm going to go ahead and cut that out. If you make your bump, bumpy lines too small, it's going to take quite a long time to cut this out. It'll still work. It'll still look nice. Um, it'll just take a little bit longer. Okay, so I have my bumps cut out. Now I'm just going to go ahead and cut the slits. And what you want to do is fold those up so that it's making a line. Those like I said, are going to be our tabs. That's how we're going to glue it to our petals so that it's standing up and it's three-dimensional. Now, I think it's easiest to go ahead and glue that together first. So you're almost rolling it up so it makes like a cylinder. Okay. I'm just going to go ahead and use a piece of tape quickly so you can see what we're doing here. I'm not wasting a whole lot of time. Then what you're going to do is you're going to take that middle of the daffodil that you just made and you're going to put it into the center of your daffodil. What you'll do is you'll put glue on the bottom of the tabs and then you can push your hand inside and push down on those tabs till it stays. After that, you can finish it off by taking a little coffee filter. If you don't have a coffee filter, you can just use a piece of a, uh, white paper that you cut into a circle shape. Okay? You can leave it plain white. You can add some color to it if you want. I added color to this one and then actually put some water on it so that it blended together a little bit. You're going to take your pincher fingers, pinch the center, and then with your other hand, come up so it's like a, a C shape, like that. You want it to look kind of poopy though. Put some glue in the center and stick that right down in there. Now we don't see those tabs. It covers that up and it makes it look pretty. And there you have your finished daffodil. So it will look something like this. And you're all done. I hope you have a good time making your daffodil and that it brings a little bit of sunshine to your house.